Hey guys, and welcome back to Fortune Finds. Today, I'm gonna to be just getting ready with you guys. There's really no point or purpose to this video. The point and purpose being to come hang out with me while I test out some newer products that I recently bought. The top one being that I'm super, super excited for. <laughs> Narcissist Wanted Palette Limited Edition came back, bought it. My hair today is brought to you by two loose braids that I let air dry and then I put some bumble and bumble dry texture in my hair. As far as my face, I washed my face this morning. I put on serum, I put on my Exuviance, the daily moisturizer with SPF 30, and then I doused my face in some liquid highlighter. And we're just gonna work over top of that. So that's where we're starting. I bought this a really long time ago. I wanna say I bought this over a year ago and I never opened it. This is the Becca Under Eye Brightening Corrector. First of its kind, full coverage cream corrector completely eradicates the appearance of under eye darkness by brightening and evening skin tone. Apply it underneath concealer to color correct or you can apply it over top as well for like a luminous effect. I'm just gonna go in with the finger and I'm just gonna put this underneath the eye. I just put like the ittiest, bittiest amount on. I remember I bought it at Ulta and when I was looking at it, there was an older woman in the aisle and she was like, oh my God, life changing product. You should really buy it, it's amazing. And I'm shocked I haven't tried it since that experience. That already did a really great job of bringing light and brightening that. <laughs> wow, this might be a new treasure. I'm just gonna hop into this really quick and make them even before moving on to the rest of my face. Wow, honestly, even if you didn't wanna apply makeup and just throw some of this underneath it, that really brightens up the under eye. Wow, that's pretty bomb. All right, I'm gonna take some of my L'Oreal Infallible up to 24 hour fresh wear foundation. And I'm gonna pounce this into the skin. Catrice Liquid Camouflage. Haven't worn this in a hot minute. Let's put that over the Becca. I'm like very, very sad that it is Labor Day. Like so sad, guys. You have no idea how sad I am. I love the Shore House. You had to see me when we got here. I was like elated to be back here. And now it's like it's the last unofficial week of the summer, the weekend. Oh my God, I'm so sad. <laughs> I wish it could be summer like all year round. I love fall though, but the thing with fall is like for me, I know the inevitable is coming. Halloween is my favorite holiday, um, but I know what's right around the corner and that my friends is winter. None of the recent concealers I've tried out have went well for me. You guys saw in my BH Cosmetics, that concealer. I ended up working. Oh, wait, 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 plot. there's a plot twist. It worked for me so well when I, in the BH Cosmetics video that I did, when I mixed in that concealer with my moisturizer, but then in my recent vlog, it like did not mix well at all. It was like a cake face disaster. I found this the other day, I lost it. This is my Maybelline Snapscara, and I can't remember where the hell I found it. Oh my God, I'm losing my mind. Uh, love when my sharpener opens up inside my makeup bag. That's always fun. 20,000 years later, Anastasia Beverly Hills, Brow Wiz. I recently watched Kathleen Lights. She did a video on the Glossier, the brow flick, and I felt her on all types of levels when she was using that. Like, I feel the same exact way. I don't know if I brought it this weekend. It's like, I want it to work for me, but my eyebrows are two different shapes, and it's like very hard to reshape a brow with the brow flick. I use it and I feel like if I did it right, if I just like could get the hang of it, I would look like my brows are microbladed. But it's like, I just, I can't. Like it just looks like they're very distant. Not even cousins, like step cousins, honestly. The brows are on. I cannot believe myself, but I forgot my brow gel at home. Who does that? Like, am I even a pro at makeup? I don't think so. Anyway, what are you guys doing? What did you do for Labor Day? What are you doing for Labor Day? I'm not really sure when this video is going up, but I would love to know how you celebrated the end of your summer. I, for one, love a good brow cleanup. Hate putting on the brows, but I enjoy cleaning them up afterwards. Take my eco tool sponge and I'm just gonna blend this out. Should we bake? We should probably bake. 
just a little bit. Bella Pierre Cosmetics HD Finishing Powder. This stuff just like scares me because it's like straight up white. I'm gonna have the brightest under eyes in all the land. All about a straight nose, which I don't have. And that line is not straight. <laughs> Some of that powder up top. This is a first impressions. I'm gonna take this light brown right here on a JH35. And let's start playing. Oh my God, I love NARS. I like cannot, I feel like I'm not gonna be able to talk a lot in this video because I am just gonna be shook by how beautiful these shadows are and oh, my god that is so freaking pretty i'm putting it a little higher than my crease because i don't want this shade to get lost you guys know i have hooded eyes so that means when i open my eyes i want to be able to see that shadow a little bit i really want this deep brown oh my lanta Wow, that is pigmented. And I'm kind of like blending it into the crease. Going back in with that first brush, I'm just gonna blend. Kind of wanna lay this red down up here. I don't know. I'm just gonna pat this all over the lid. I don't know, I'm kind of into this. A smaller blending brush. I'm gonna go into this brown. I'm gonna grab this shade right here. I don't know, it's really pretty. And I kind of just wanna put that all over what I just did. Hello. What's that? Art. What are you doing with that? Right now? Just about done. I kind of brought that dark brown underneath the eye, but before I did that, Sorry, I don't know what happened. I was talking to Mike and I realized that I didn't hit record again. I'm taking this really light brown, putting that underneath the entire bottom of the lid. And just keeping that to the outer third of the eye. And then I'm bringing what's ever left on in to the inner corner. I'm just gonna reinforce this dark brown a little bit. I love our smoked out eye. This more like a little tamed shimmer. It's like a, a little less shimmery than the other shimmers. Hit that on the brow bone. I'm gonna take this shade right here. Yes, no, 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 this. Marc Jacobs Fine Liner. In black, I just really needed a black eyeliner. So here we are. I might regret this, honestly. I'm just putting it right above my lash line. Wow, this is really easy to control this liner. Well, this liner is actually insane. I'm like winging it out like ever so slightly. Like the littlest wing, littlest wing. Little baby wing. I just have hooded eyes, so I feel like wings are a little hard. <laughs> Tight line the bottom. Wow, this liner gets my stamp of approval da damn i want to see what the eyes look like done i really like this palette and i want to finish off the rest of my face but i want to see what the eyes look like wow new favorite eyeliner maybelline snap scara in black cherry it, i was excited i thought it was like gonna look like a dark purple but it kind of just looks like black it doesn't get too clumpy. It goes on really nicely and it's brand new. Dust that bake off, even though it's like gone. Huda Beauty 3D highlighter palette and grab the bronzer in here called Aruba. It's kind of dark for me, but I'm just gonna go with it. Oh, I love this 
this palette. In the Maldives, Maldives, I don't know how the hell you say that. Beautiful, gorgeous. Take Bora Bora, the blush. Just take that on a little angled blush brush. Hmm, yes. Line my lips with Bobbi Brown lip pencil in the shade Nude. This is a very loved lip liner, as you can tell. Flower Beauty in the shade Peachy Nude. This is one of their cream lipsticks. I have not used this yet. Mm. Wow. I kind of want something a little bit more matte, so I'm gonna take this BH Liquid Linen in Vanilla and just pop this in the middle. Yeah. All right, guys, and this is the finished makeup look. I'm out, oh God, I'm outside, pardon me. I was trying to find some good lighting in the house, but like it's that awkward time where like the sun is going down and everything in the house, it's just like all my makeup is blown out and you can't really see it. So I'm outside, this is my makeup in the real daylight, which I feel like is good for my channel once in a while. I feel like a lot of the times the beauty lights blow things out, you can't really see them. So this is what the finished product looks in the daytime. I'm sorry that this video was a little bit of a hot mess and I'm also sorry that I didn't really talk a lot through this one, but I was just so excited to try out these new products. Like I love this eyeshadow. This Marc Jacobs fine liner is amazing. Like honestly, I think this eyeliner might be my new best friend, but Mike and I are off to dinner. We have the makeup and I think I'm gonna get changed. I feel like a tigeress, like something dark and smoky so maybe i'll wear i'm thinking i'm either gonna wear cheetah print or like some kind of animal print so hopefully i'll get a little snippet of the outfit i'll include that in here but i really hope that you guys enjoyed this video i had a wonderful time as always i'm in the happiest place and I'm just having a great time and I cannot wait to kick off this vacation with tonight and this makeup look. I said on this vacation I want to be playing with makeup. I know it's like a beach vacation and it's supposed to be like low key but I have a lot of new products in the lineup and I want to test them out and let you guys know how they are. So I will definitely be heavy in the makeup. Expect a lot of vlogs coming up coming your way so be sure you're subscribed so you get my videos and also click that bell button this way you get the notification i had a great time as always thank you guys so much for joining me and i will see you in my next one bye finders Mwah.